Hi, you all. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to make money holders or gift card holders, whatever you want to call it. That's what we're going to make. So um, it all started with me making a gift for a coworker and I made her a gift card holder and she loved it. She was like, I usually don't save these type of things, but I'm going to save it. Of course, because she's Delta all the way. So she was so excited by it. So I decided to start making them. So I'm just going to show you my process. So stay tuned. So we're going to start off in Canva. And I have my um, background as black. And I'm going to do a retirement theme um, money card holder. So as you can see, I found I went to elements on the left hand side, typed in retirement, found something that I really like. And it has this gold color. And I don't know what this is exactly called, but I put a sell sticker and a little star thing comes up. And that's where I'm gonna use that for my pricing and edit the image color. And you can kind of just do everything the way you like, just put it where you feel that it would fit. And um, I also found, I put gold for you. I wanted something like fancy, luxury-like. And I found this little thing to put in the background of her um card so i'm gonna let you watch from here um i'm just doing a little bit of editing and just cleaning up and making sure everything looks right then i'm going to the text on the left hand side and i'm going to type in you can type in whatever amount that you're going to give um as a gift so pretty much we're just keeping it simple and then at the bottom you can add you know from tt to whoever i'm also going to do a graduation one I'm kind of not feeling this image, so I found one on Google, a graduation image that I feel would fit. And you can remove the background also in Canva. That's another great feature. You click on edit image and you click on remove and voila, the image or the background will be removed. And I can use that image. I'm thinking I want to edit the background color and give it a blue. I'm not feeling the gold for it. So I think I'm gonna edit it and change it blue. Okay, so I'm liking that blue much better. And we have to find our little sticker thing with the price again. So you can go to recently used, find what I just used, and it can, you can click on Starburst. So that's another Starburst cell to find that image. And there we go. Um, also, when you're editing, you can just do as you feel. This is just an example. Um, add the year, add different things to fit your needs. So it's just so much more that you can do with Canva in terms of editing. Also, you can click on position and center everything just to get it to look nice and neat. Okay, I had a dub moment. You know the little hole that, that's in the middle? I could have used shapes and welded it and stuff, but we're gonna do it this way. I found a Walmart gift card online and what I did was trace that little hole. And once I traced the hole, I made sure to increase the threshold. And I, again, traced it. And I was able to use that um, image to put into my gift card that I made. Okay, you may have noticed that when I traced it, everything came off from that area. But it's a quick and simple fix. Just right click, release compound path, and I can pull out the shape that I want and place it onto the gift card. So now we have what we want and I'm gonna click on the color palette and make it black so you guys can see it really well. And I just hit file and merge my images in. Um, and then once you do that, you drag it to the area. And then I would highlight the whole thing and group everything together so that way it's easier to cut. And I'm just putting this, this little hole on all, all of my images that I have created. I decided to do a print and cut, or you can cut it out by hand, whichever method you choose is fine, on cardstock. And I'm using my regular inkjet printer for this task. Oh, I have been searching for the chapstick pouches. There are none. <laughs> they are literally gone. So I went to the dollar store and I found some, some chapstick and I'm just tearing it off. And this is 
very aggravating because <laughs> I had to make sure the paper's off or sometimes I just blended it in with whatever card I had. So this is what I'm going to use on the retirement one. And I'm going to put the $20 in. So I used the hot glue gun and slid it in 20 and this is how it looks. This is just a super easy project. Um, you can use somebody's face or just any images you choose offline. It's just cute to give out as gifts or even some people are even selling it, but I just think it adds a little bit of ump to your gift. Please remember to hit that subscribe button, like, comment, and share. Happy crafting, everyone.